Hi, and welcome to my video on how solar thermal works with a dual immersion hot water tank. So these are the th solar thermal panels on the roof of the house. And you can see the pipes coming out on the left at the bottom. They're circulated by a pump. The pump is located here above the hot water tank below the two dials. The pump is actuated by a thermostat. When the glycol or antifreeze gets warm enough, the pump starts circulating it. Here you can see that the pressure gauges are low because the system's turned off. This is the thermal controller for the solar panels. It shouldn't need controlling as it's automatic. Here we have the peak immersion, which is the top one, which runs on expensive electricity, which should be left off. And down here we have the off-peak immersion, which is the cheap electricity, which should be left on. These are thermostatically controlled and only kick in if the water wasn't hot enough. The two insulated pipes running down the wall and into the tank are for um, running the heat exchanger. So the glycol when it's hot enough is circulated by the pump through the hot water tank and the heat from the glycol is then passed into the hot water tank taking off the edge of the water within the tank and making the off-peak immersion work less hard saving electricity. So the th solar panels take the edge off so that it doesn't have to work as hard. This is the thermostat to control the pump on the solar thermal which adds a loop of glycol through the cylinder which warms up the water and takes the edge off. These two switches are the night and day, peak and off peak. The night one should be left on all the time and the bottom one should be left on off all the time. This will ensure best usage of your electricity to heat hot water but the solar panels will take the edge off the water so your night one won't have to work as hard. This is the expansion tank, gives you mains pressure as the cylinder is on ground level. Pressure gauges, circulation pump for the solar thermal, you can see the pipes going into the loft. Thanks for watching, please subscribe and like, there are many other videos covering these sort of things in my playlists.